A bill making its way through the legislature would increase fines for those who sell tobacco to minors. Almost nine out of 10 adults who smoke cigarettes every day say they started before they were 18. While most wouldn't argue that reducing teen vaping is good, I spoke to one store owner who said there might be some public backlash. Minute Mart at 41st and Harvard has been Jason Mahmood's family-run business for 27 years. He says preventing tobacco sales to minors is top of mind while training employees. If you're unsure, ask for the ID, and if it's not present or available, then just decline the sale. It's much better to play it safe than sorry. Current law finds the store clerk for selling to minors. House Bill 3331 would also hold store owners responsible. Ticket fines would start at $250 and increase to $1,000 for second or third offenses. Store owners could also risk losing their license to sell tobacco. Mahmoud is conflicted and admits it's likely an unpopular opinion that part of it is unfair. For example, if I drove my best friend's car, and I was uh, speeding, I would get the ticket, not my best friend. However, as an Oklahoman, he's aware of the teen tobacco problem. 21% of Oklahoma teens reported vaping in the last month compared to 10% nationwide, according to research. Legislature thinks that this is a way to help prevent it. It could be a good thing. Thomas Larson with the Tobacco Settlement Endowment Trust, or TSET, said the bill was designed because it's inexcusable when the state offers free training for store clerks owners could require. Store owners are responsible for training their employees, uh, so this is a way to hold them accountable for, for their their employees and for what goes on in their stores. Mahmoud said he already gets pushback from some adults about showing ID. You don't see my gray hair? <laughs> some stores require an ID check for tobacco no matter the age. Mahmoud said he would too if this becomes law and said any persnickety customers would just have to understand. Oklahoma lawmakers also passed a law last year holding minors accountable when caught buying or having tobacco products with required education and fines if that education wasn't completed.